It's here. It's finally here. After all these years. <sighs> oh my goodness, y'all. Hey, yo, squad. Guess what? Guess what I just read today on my phone on Instagram. <sighs> The creator of Peach Creek just announced and confirmed that in the next couple weeks or less, we could be getting the official. We're gonna, we're gonna be getting the first official first episode of Peach Creek. The, the first episode of Peach Creek. And finally, after all this time, after two years, two years. And you finally gonna put this out for us? I feel spoiled. I feel like, goddamn. 2020, the, you know, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. The 2020s has been some of the weirdest times of my life so far. This is, the, this is the weirdest decade I've ever lived so far in my entire life. The 2020s is very odd, not gonna lie. This, Peach Creek, this is a way to continue our nostalgia from the 90s, bruh. This is a reboot that we all wanted and needed so desperately. If you guys don't believe me, I will read off the official post from the creator himself, George, off of Instagram, you feed me. So, so let me put on my spectacles for this because I need to see. I need to see. Ooh, look at all this. Episode one. Episode one is done. Yes, it's actually done. We're currently finalizing the sound design, sound effects, music, ambient noises. This will be done within the next two to three weeks, most likely sooner. In the meantime, the raw animation with all recorded voice lines and some temporary sound effects is uploaded as an unlisted video on YouTube. Bro, it's already on YouTube. It's, it's there. It's just, it's just, it's just, it's just unlisted. So what's next? Well, I'm going to be starting on episode two in the next few days. A lot of learnings and takeaways have come from episode one, as well as some ways to streamline how I work and what shots work and what don't. So hopefully this means much faster turn, a much, much faster turnaround. So hopefully this means a much, much faster turnaround. I'm so, so sorry that it took this long to release. Bro, no, don't even apologize. G jo hey, George, Peach Creek creators, do not apologize because we knew this was gonna come out regardless. We knew this is unofficial. I mean, we knew how long this was gonna take we knew how hard this was bro we knew we knew so therefore bro we you don't we need to say no sorry because we, we have faith in this the whole entire time yeah we, it was people including myself my girlfriend included as well that was a little annoyed at the fact that at the fact that we couldn't watch no grown up ed and eddie but we knew at the end of the day that it was coming we just didn't know when but we got it it's fish it's a it's coming it's coming very soon y'all hey yo squad it's officially here and i'm so damn happy Oh man, as you can see, your boy, you know what I'm saying, commented. If y'all want to follow me on Instagram, the link to that will be in the description below as well. Yo, this is so amazing, yo. I really, really hope if people are able to do it, people take inspiration from this and start doing this with like other cartoons we grew up with, like Codename Kiss Next Door or Dexter's Laboratory or something like Ed and Eddie, bro. Like, and apparently, like, this man is already working on episode two, so we, you already know we're gonna get full seasons in the future, like. We're gonna get like an, we're gonna get an actual like show of Ed and Eddie all over again, but this time, bro, it's gonna be way different. And I'm all here for it. You got plank, and you got plank. Oh my goodness, bro! I'm about to pass out. Hold on, bro. Eventually. So we, it looks like there's every single character right there in that picture. So for everybody in the AO squad that didn't see uh, all the characters, here they are right here in these pictures. You got Nas, Kevin, Jimmy, Sarah. Um, I keep forgetting this one. The Angry Beaver, uh, Kanker Sister. Then you got Ed, you got Eddie, Double D, Marie, Lee. And then you have Ralph, Johnny, and Plank. It's Lee, Marie, and... um. Why did I ever, bro, why do I always forget her name, bro? What is going on? But yeah, one of my homies in the comments back in the last video saying like, Double D done took, uh, done took his crush, bro. Done took Marie from you, man. What you gonna do about that, man? You gonna fight Double D? You gonna, you gonna try to get Marie back, man? What's up, man? What's up? But anyway, um, hold on. Also, another thing talking about the Kanker sisters, somebody else said that uh, in the AO squad told me that uh, Lee has three eyes. I don't remember this woman having three eyes, bro. Hold on real quick. Whoa, wait a minute. Whoa, hold on. She does have three eyes. Bro, out of all the episodes I watched, and I think this is the big picture show uh, movie. Because I could tell by the dandelions behind them, they were chasing the air boys. So it's like, 
Bro, they got. I've never paid attention to her having three eyes. Because whenever they, because yeah, whenever they would do it, yeah, it would be like this. They would just show one eye each and every single time. This girl got three eyes, bro. I am baffled. I am. What the hell? Anyway, what what just really what just really makes this so weird for me is like, what are the odds of all this happening right now? I literally just recorded uh, the Peach Creek reaction like two, three days ago. And the day after that, George goes on Instagram, you know, the the damn creator of Peach Creek, then a day later decides to like announce episode one coming out in the next couple weeks or less. God must be looking out for me, yo. Like, a, like, like I want to say thank you, Heavenly God. Thank you, Heavenly Spirit because this is a good ass time to be alive i'm not even gonna lie to you and speaking on the last video i want to say thank y'all so so much for the love and the support and the like damn that y'all showed my last video bro i even got a comment of somebody you know i guess uh, acknowledging that i do all this by myself editing recordings producing writing all of it so basically homeboy was just like yo if i need some help reach out and shit i ain't gonna lie you know what i'm saying some help will definitely help you feel me and the only way y'all can honestly help now would just like, subscribe, and if y'all want to, this is obviously, if y'all want to do a little super thanks, hey, I'm all there for it. You know what I'm saying? It will help. It will help. It will help exponentially. You feel me? So if that's how you guys want to do it, y'all can do it. If y'all don't want to do it that way, liking the video is good. Subscribing is good. Clicking the bell is good. If y'all want to do all three, clicking the bell, liking, and subscribing, that's oh, Thank you so much. That means that's just... That's enough right there. But if y'all want to add as a bonus, the super thanks, I can't even say, I don't know how much I can say thank you at that point. Like, I really can't. I, I just deeply appreciate it. For real, for real. You know, not to mention too, your boy also saving up for a new PC. So in that way I can have a better workflow. And then on my gaming channel, I can have a way more smoother and better experience when it comes to playing games for everybody watching and for myself, of course, playing. So, you know, you know there is a goal that I need to reach in order to get what I want. So until that day come, that will definitely help y'all a lot. And uh, yeah, I just appreciate it, man. I really do deeply, deeply. All right, so before we head out, we're gonna analyze each character real quick before this uh, new episode come out. We got Naz pretty much looking the exact same. I expected Naz to look pretty casual. She still has like that rocker-like style, but she's still, you know, pretty chill. You know, she ain't really doing much, I can tell. She, you know, probably just doing her thing, working, being with Kevin, it looks like, and for when it comes to Kevin, and when it comes to Kevin, he just, he's still wearing that greenish sweater long sleeve he's been wearing with the red hat. You know what I'm saying? Got some facial hair now. I feel like he might still bully the Ed boys. He might, or at least tolerate him. I feel like he might tolerate him. Uh, Jimmy's a little bit more sassier, it looks like now. Uh, Sarah just looks like she ain't having it with nobody at this point. Like, everybody got grown. Her tolerance for everybody went down. As, the, as she got grown, her tolerance went down. That's how it looks like to me. Uh, let's see, next post. Um, we got this canker sister all up on Ed. Ed being all oblivious as usual, cheesing for no reason. He's looking directly at the camera, even though he's not put, you know, he's not supposed to, but it's Ed being Ed. Then you got um Ed over here, double D. We going in order. We got double D over here. Literally all up on Marie. He he feeling Marie, I see. In the Ed and Eddie one back back when we were um back in the day in the old cartoon, double D was trying so desperately to get away from the canker sister. Marie, but now he's just like, oh shit, shoot, how you doing today, Marie? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I can show you my little my my aquarium, Leo. You know, I got a lot. You know what I'm saying? Like, that would be about to be his little weird self still, but I feel like he might have a little bit of riz up in there. You feel me? Then you got Eddie. He's by himself. Like, I thought he was with Lee. Like, ain't he, I, what's going on? Why he by himself looking all smug? Like, what's going on with Eddie? Obviously, he he up to no good. He ready to scam the next very person he see. So we we gonna see how that go for him, and there's Lee just standing there with three eyes. Uh, Ralph, R just being Ralph. I can't really say much about him. He just does his thing, his own thing, based off his own culture. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Johnny just being a lonely, as antisocial as dude with plank. And the crazy thing about Johnny was, um, I thought Johnny was black. The whole entire time I was a kid, I thought Johnny was black. But no, he actually just a little white boy, which is crazy. I thought he was a black boy. But I guess, I guess not. Uh, Plank. Plank. I want to see what kind of storyline Plank going to have. Because I feel like they didn't show him enough in the old days. So I would like to see Plank have a lot more shine. A little bit more shine. 
uh nowadays to see how that go uh but yeah y'all that's about it that's gonna be about it for this video a little update little news update for peach creek uh pretty much confirming that it will be coming out in the next couple weeks so most likely this month in july which i'm very excited about y'all uh get your popcorn ready your candy anything that's gonna make you relax and excited and just just hyper focused tunnel vision focused on a damn cartoon get it Get it before the damn thing come out. So now we, that way we can all be prepared. You know what I'm saying? I'm super excited, y'all. Like, I cannot explain or emphasize any more enough how happy and excited I am for this damn reboot, remake, sequel, whatever you want to call it. But I, I just, I am just mortified at the fact that somebody took their time out. Oh, my goodness. I can't, I can't, I can't. Read it. And the fact that this is supposed to be like an adult version of it, too. So it's supposed to cater towards like the early 2000s, late 90s, sort of like uh, squad, you feel me, uh, community, whatever. I, I, have, I have a really good ass feeling that this, this was done right. A really great feeling that this was just done too right, bro. I'm so excited. Look at all this. Look at the Kodasak, bro. Look how they made the Kodasak. The art, the art style is so fucking dope. It's like the, it's the same art style, bro. This is I like this. Butter toast and gravy. Okay, yeah, that's right. I forgot. I forgot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what that is. My man was like, my man was treating some butter toast with gravy like crack. I ain't even gonna lie to you, bro. Like, damn, bro, it's just some butter and bread. Chill out. And at this point, since he got, it's like at this point, since he got like the first episode done, I'm just guessing maybe he can like get the other episodes out a little bit quicker. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just guessing, but I also feel like he's not going to be releasing one episode a year. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's like, what? Like, I don't, I don't expect him to do all that, but I do expect each episode to take timely manners to finish regardless. So I'm not going to put pressure on that. Like, oh, I want an episode every week. Like, that's not going to happen. And I'm pretty sure there's other people because there's another, uh, there was another animator that helped him create this. So if I could find his name, I'm definitely going to include it because it wasn't just him that worked on animation it was him and somebody else but i think it was like in terms of like the idea maybe it was george if i'm guessing yeah created by george yeah yeah, yeah. uh but yeah bro that's it y'all mark your calendars y'all mark your calendars man we about to be there in peach creek with everybody else bro we about to be going back to the cul-de-sac y'all y'all ready because i am i ain't ready like some damn mama spaghetti Anyway, y'all, y'all have a good night, blessed night, good day, blessed day, wherever y'all stay. Hey, yo, squad, we out.